Hello, YouTube. My name is Frank. Thank you for taking a few minutes to watch me unbox four mystery packages from that SpidermanBooth.com. For those of you who don't know, the cost of each box is $30, and typically you will receive five comics per box. The company guarantees that you will receive comics that collectively are of a greater value than what you paid. If you buy two or more boxes, you get free shipping. Now that's nice, but what really excites buyers of that Spider-Man booth mystery boxes is the opportunity to win randomly inserted GPs or grand prizes of very highly desired and valuable comics like Hulk 181 or Amazing Spider-Man 300, or this week's grand prize, Amazing Spider-Man 39, the beginning of John Romita Sr.'s first run on the title, and the book is signed by Stan Lee. I'm about to show you the contents of my four boxes. Winning any jackpot is hard and generally very unlikely. What you have to do is look at the contents and determine, do you see value beyond the $30 you paid? That's the real question. If you visit the That Spider-Man Booth YouTube channel or their Instagram page, you can learn about numerous giveaways they sponsor weekly, especially on Monday. That is very nice and it's very exciting. I look forward to the Monday Live at 5, that's West Coast time, show every week to see if I won one of their many giveaways. However, that's a long shot. Let's look at my box, my books, my books, my box, and determine how much value I received for my money. Now, I haven't seen any of these yet, but I did prep them so that it would go faster. Here's the first box. Book number one. Mighty Thor. Book number two, Guardians of the Galaxy, number 11, filler books, sure, The Hulk, that's interesting, I've never seen this one before. The Hope number 11, no idea. Some of you comic heads will recognize these books, but they mean nothing to me so far. Angela, he said it's worth $30. I think I received this before my last Spider-Man box. And last in the first box, Uh, Harley Quinn, it says worth $35. So that very first box, we know that, and this is really cool looking. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, I don't know the artist. I'm sure you guys will right away, but that's a really cool looking cover. Really cool looking book. Uh, I have no idea what <laughs> number it is or anything, but you can see it's pretty cool. So if we go by the first box, we have a minimum of a $35 book and a $30 book and a few filler books. So I'd say that's value to me. All right, let's look at the second box. First book, The New Avengers. What number? It's number 52. Second book, Superman, some type of 10th anniversary. Is that what it says? <laughs> the 10 cent adventure, that was completely wrong. Uh, let's see, number one. Third book, Marvel's Eye of the Camera. 
very unique. I, let's see, number three. Not familiar with this book at all. Fourth book in the second box. The Mighty Thor. It says worth 10 bucks. Nice looking cover. I have no idea what number. 705. Don't know anything about it. It's a cool looking cover though. And the last book in the second box. Oh, that's cold. You got to admit, that's cold. That's cold. That's a nice book right here. Um, Ghost Rider and Silver Surfer Black. I have no idea which comic it is, but that's nice. I got to admit, I like this box too. If I go by just the dollar value that they put on it, 40 and a 10, that's 50 bucks. I paid 30. I really, lo really love this cover. I mean, this is really nice. I don't know which book it is. I'm not going to waste you guys' time taking it out of the, uh, you know, out of the bag and board and see, but you'll find out, I'm sure. But it's a really, really cool book. Wow. All right. So that was the second box. Third box. First book. Uh, new X Men Messiah Complex. Number 40, New X-Men, number 46. Second book. Uh, Teen Titans, number two. Uh, number two. Kind of cool looking. Third book in the third box, Superman, the, the Adventures of Superman from the Funeral of a Friend story arc, number 498, kind of cool. Fourth book in the third box. Green Lantern, number 34. And the last book in the third box. Oh, well, that's nice. I've seen a few people unbox this book and I did want this book. Yes, beautiful. Beautiful. Very nice. That is nice. Wow. I'm very happy about this. So in this uh, third box, the key book I got was this one. And even though I would say this is really the only key book in the box, I would say just this book alone is worth the value of what I paid for the box. I'm impressed with that. Last box. Box number four. First book, Venom First Host number one. Very nice. They say it's worth $25. It's really a cool looking book, though. Very nice. Yeah, I do like that. Who doesn't like Venom, right? Speaking of which, second book, another Venom. Uh, Venom number eight. Variant, obviously. I'm sorry, I'm not telling you guys who the uh, who the artist is on these books, but there's a very good reason for that. I don't know. So, uh, anyway, really cool looking book, also. So so far, that's forty dollars according to this. Third book in the last box, The Incredible Hulk. Planet Hulk Arc, uh, number 100. The Incredible Hulk, Planet Hulk. Uh, okay, pretty cool. 
Oh, I'm sorry, it's almost over. Fourth book in the fourth box. X-Men Legacy, number 21. And the very last book in the very last box I got. Yeah, a little anticlimactic for sure. Uh, it is Spider Man vs. Deadpool number 37. Yeah, not familiar with this one. So there you have it. That box, mm, I don't know. I'd say that was okay, but definitely not as good as the other boxes, even though, you know, two Venom comics. I mean, that's pretty cool. So there you have it. Uh, no GP. Like I said, I didn't necessarily expect one because it is very difficult to win a GP just in general. But, uh, but if you think that those comics are worth $30 a box, then go to thatmysterybox.com and order right now. And if you don't, then thank you very much for watching. I'll see you another time.